Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to Stranded Alien Dawn. I hope you're all well. Right, so you'll see that all I've done now is we're going to get these moved across during this solar eclipse because they're not actually going to affect anything. So we're going to move these here. So we have this section to build on if we need to as well and we need to move it all around. That was my thinking anyway. And we're getting rid of those and building a new one of these. So we'll get we'll start just using these ones because cost-wise they're so much cheaper. And we're moving that one to line it up there. So we'll start making this a little bit neater. And what we're going to do here is we are going to start this. So this is going to be pure pure storage room. We've got an aircon there. And this is going to be... How am I going to do this? So we are going to go like so. And then we're going to go... Like so. This is going to be pure, as I say, storage. So I think we can go... We can go there, so they can still get that one, and then we can go there. And then, can we get another one? I don't think we... Oh, we can. We can go there, right? If we go... Yeah, if we go there, speed them up a tiny bit, and then we can get... We can move that wardrobe. Because unfortunately, you can't move certain things and then we can just get the clothing in there and then once that's all done we'll, we'll be good i know there's no roof on that so some of it might go bad but um yeah it is what it is if there's one that we don't have certain things on you can do empty and deconstruct once they're ready i'll wait for them to be built though before we move them over but that's essentially what we're going to do here and this is going to be set to minus minus 10 or whatever it is and we'll try and keep this a complete freezer room that's going to be the plan anyway and uh, obviously we've got the turret up. I'm expecting to see some more dangerous creatures coming soon as well. So we need to get a whole bunch of wood sorted. So we'll get some of this cut. I'm going to get all everything that I can cut we're going to do. Um, do. We need hay. We don't need anything else. And then we should be good. It shouldn't take too long. The bricks should start flying out. So we'll leave them doing that as well. And then I think we're going to send... Let's see what sort of expeditions we've got at the moment. Nothing there. Ancient alien ship. Ancient language must be... Okay, that's fine. These are all scavenged. That's silicon. I kind of want... We might need to do an explore. Crash landing pod. I don't think that one's ideal. I think what we're going to do is send... Hmm... I kind of... He is sleeping. So when he gets up, we're going to send Talos on one there. Hopefully we can find someone. We'll see what he comes back with. The expedition is starting to take, obviously, longer and longer. So... Speed that up, though. We're over halfway through the summer here as well. I think we need to get more insect meat. So if there's a place that we can get it, we will. Because that means we can craft more... Fuel, I think. So if we do... That's still going. Okay, we'll leave those two on that. And there we good. We're all opened out, aren't we? So we're in a good spot. And what are we doing here? Okay. And obviously, I know we've got the fridge there. But again, once we've got this up and running, we can actually... We can get rid of the fridge. I think it's a waste of electricity if we can do this and use the aircon instead. But I know that requires CPUs as well. So let's see what we've got here. Research-wise. Win. Okay. And I want Quinn. Hmm, I think that's okay. Alice is going, obviously. And then Grayson. Yeah, he's on construction. Cool. Leave him doing all this bit here. Everyone is vomiting like crazy. So silly. Did turn off their raw food, didn't I? Yeah, they should be right. Used to last forever. Who have we got on cutting duty as well? Cut. Cut. Uh, kind of one. Okay, I need, I need you crafting almost, Grayson. So, Alice is out. Win. Connor, Connor, I'm gonna put on one on cutting. I think, and we're gonna change him to two on those as well. And I'm gonna get him cutting. Oh, he's gonna butcher first, actually, isn't he? We've got quite a few. Chris is doing it as well, so we, that should be fine. We'll use that to make oil. We got them on the go? Yep, we got another going as well. Perfect. If we can research the 
Oh, did not mean to do that. If we can research the, uh, what's it called? Balloon optimization here. I'm actually going to get rid of the laser pistol. We're going to do balloon optimization because that means it's only 15 oil to do uh, to do an expedition. So one expedition, we can just keep going to that oil place over and over. And we can top that up quite heavily. And that should be pretty good. Grayson is smashing through some bricks. Once again, vomiting. Nice. Spot a circle of trees surrounded by a light mist. Even at a distance, I get a tingly feeling in my stomach. I wonder what it might be. That's one of those I feel good, isn't it? Yeah, they're annoying. A mystical grove. Go away. We need... I want another survivor, man. How's our power looking? I think it's okay. Once this one's built... It's going up, isn't it? So, oh, no, it's going down again now. Insufficient storage, it seems. They hurry up and build this, we won't be. Are you cutting? The Connor is... Why are you transporting? Oh, he's finishing his first job, isn't he? He should be... Cutting. Got well, him cutting. It shouldn't take him long. If we can get him up higher, we can then scavenge more. So I imagine if they're at a 10 physical, he'll probably bring home a ridiculous amount from the expedition, so... I think defense-wise guns, though, just with these three, will be pretty good. So that sniper's a, a great one. That's ready to be built. Unpowered devices. So our power is not great right now. He's given off 4 out of 40. That's the only problem with the summer. And obviously because it's night time, these aren't going to work. It's almost like you need to plow through these and just put loads of batteries in. We could research battery optimization if we have it. Oh, it doesn't look like we've got it yet. A malfunction wind turbine just to add misery there. That's okay. Maybe we need the thing on the lights as well. Uh, what's it called? Light and heat. We need a day-night sensor. Oh, it's one CPU core. Activates during the night. Does that need to be outside? I think it does. Yeah. Alright, if we put one of these sensors down. Maybe over here. No, it can't be there. That's not going to connect to the electrics. If we just stick a day-night sensor in there. And we'll set that to something the same as these lights. A large burning object, most definitely a chunk of spaceship, was seen crashing in the distance. If left as it is, anything salvageable will perish in the following days. Space junk. I don't know if we need that right now. We need to be getting on the, uh, the higher research kind of thing, right? Got a lot of crops ready to go as well. This is why we really need this done. We need this to be refrigerated. How much are we short at the moment? It's done a good chunk. He has done most of the roof as well, so it should be fine. And once he's built, uh, construction shelf. All right, he should go and do the CPU. Can I get someone else? I don't know. Talus is on it. Hey, Talus. <laughs> you got no clothes on. That fueled up? No. Okay. And how are we looking here, Quinn? Ancient language. Talus hitting crafting seven. That's huge. Uh, all right. They're just doing some leather leggings there. Tell us back on that. Can you do the CPU? What did you do? Oh, you did it. Nice. What are they going to do first? I think he's going to do this aircon unit, and then he'll do this one. Which is fine. We'll get that blasting at a negative. But, yeah, in the daytime, these fill up quick. But I think our problem here is nighttime. This, these drain excessively quick. Uh, I'm going to... Deconstruct that as well. It's not needed. Uh, but yeah, getting these electric furnaces for brick is huge. That's so much quicker. So, so much quicker. And then what have we got in here? We're okay. Most of our stuff is alright anyway. Because our food's in the fridge at the moment, isn't it? Yeah, it's looking okay. Alright, I can see that he doesn't have much. I don't want to give him a fur cap, though. Or a coat. He'll be fine. Old gear. As long as he's got shoes on. He should be okay. Connor. Infected. Ah, vision implants infected again. 
That's happening more and more frequent, isn't it? First aid kits are getting low, too. Are we researched on those? I think we are. Yeah, we're okay. Uh, we should probably make sure we've always got three in stock. Yeah, that's good. And ahead of that is bandages, right? Until three. And then... Yeah, if we go like that, look, we should be fine. Cool. And they're crafting fuel as well. Beautiful. Or well, they're fermenting fuel, I should say. What's it looking like here? Okay. And stop waiting for ingredients. Do we have any oil? Veg oils? We do. We got 150. We're looking good then. We got a load more silicon that's going to come from this as well, which is nice. And he is cutting stuff down, so that's good as well. See how this... I don't think they can get at these, actually. I've just realized. So let's move these out of the way. <laughs> They don't think to go over the bed. That's why we can't finish those off. That'll help with the temp in here, I think. Although they're pretty good at the moment. They'll fill up in seven hours as well, based on these. That's pretty good. And these, they run really bad in the summer. Look at that. Really, really bad. Is there an improved version of these? hope so. This is going to be good. I don't know what you get from this, so I think that's going to come in pretty handy. And that's almost, oh, most of that's harvestable as well. We are going to have a ridiculous amount of grain. Wow. Look at him getting all these done. Nice. And we've hit another heat wave. Take your clothes off, everyone. I don't want a proper horde to come. We haven't had one yet where they attack properly. I've got a couple of plans that I want to do here. One is going to be deconstructing the gate. We don't need a gate. I don't know why I put it on. And then we're going to go with... I think... There's a... You could do brick fence. What's that? Integrity. Integrity is a lot better on those. I just don't think we're going to have the ingredients for it. Hmm. It's integrity on scrap metal 20. May as well go wooden. So, I was thinking something along the lines of... Building this out. Right? And then... What, what I'll do is funnel... Hmm, let me figure this out. Yeah, wooden fenced out this way, I think. We'll be okay. Those, those guys are sleeping. Yeah, wooden fence out to these, so they when they come in, we kind of want to feed them down a trap lane, don't we? We start building that out a little bit, and then we can we can fill it with turrets. So you kind of want them to keep running past this almost. If we go, I'm just gonna slow it down a little bit here. But if we go. Like so, I'm going to bring this here, and we kind of want it, I'll go to here, that'll do for now. And you can almost fill it with traps then, can't you? And you can just, I can go turrets along here, same with all the way around, and then you, you basically just have a feeder point as like here. They can all only come in one way, and then they have to go towards this. And all the way around, they're going to get ploughed by turrets and things like that. I think we'll start on that. This room's almost done. Ten bricks away. So once they are finished... And I will keep stockpiling the bricks, by the way. I think I may even put that. All of those to 300 on the bricks. I think. And that's enough to build with then, isn't it? Uh, That was wrong. That one. Cool. And then we should be in a good spot. I'm actually going to be glad for when the summer's gone a little bit. Because I think we're ready. We've got enough stuff. What am I cooking at the moment? Buttermelon pie. That's great. What else can we do? We don't want any of those. We want some tasty recipes. I think we could do some veggie kind of stew here. I don't want to use up too much oil though. And they all seem to take oil. Why can't... 
we haven't found beef berries yet or chew roots. That's very annoying. I'm yet to find chew root on any playthrough, by the way. At all. Haven't found any. Which is a bit of a shame. Anyway, let's speed it up. Let's see what we're doing here. Let's hopefully this gets finished. And then he can hurry up and do the shelving. Oh, and this is ready. Air conditioner as well. And we're crafting our next CPU, which will be the day-night sensor. Should help a little bit with the... What's it called? Because I am going to put some lighting in here as well. This is going to be a couple of... I think a couple of ceiling lamps. Just to light the place up a little bit. Now I should be able to empty and deconstruct that one at least. We'll start with that. And start moving this over. And then I can get rid of this completely. It's not needed. That way, everything should be within reach. And they should be good to go. Give me that green. Look at this. Nearly a thousand. Enough for 200 and... 60 meals. Huh. Should be enough to see us through. Honor hits uh, construction three there as well. Looks like the stone fence has started. We're going to need to mine as well, aren't we? A little bit there. One there as well. And we'll grab a couple of these. Don't know who's on mining duty, so that might stay there. And now all our bricks should start stockpiling. And this has finished. So, we can target temp this one as minus 10. And that should keep this room dandy. I think the way that's laid out, that should work. And this will all stay completely good. But what we're going to do here is we are going to take off medicines, electrical components. I, I, think, I think I'll keep, maybe I'll keep some for now. Get rid of the medicines though. And we'll also... I almost want to get rid of this. Maybe we just turn it off for now. Um, we'll keep empty and turn off. So all of that gets moved into here. I think that's the best plan here. What do we not want on these? I think we don't want these two. We're going to copy restrictions and paste this across them all. I love this feature. So good. Right, that should be everything. Everything else can go on there. And has that been changed yet? I think the room temp... Yep, so target temp is going down. 10 degrees. And we've got fuel for an expedition now as well. Unpowered devices. So, yeah, getting rid of that fridge is going to help. Let's send someone here. What do we want to do... There's a mystical grove again there. These mystical groves, all they do is make your person feel good, right? We don't need that. These explorations are taking a long time right now. We need Connor. So I'm going to send Grayson on the expedition. Where are these? All right. We should, hopefully there's enough power, we should get to see the turrets in action here, which will be good. Let's just double check this. Active circuit 3. Control circuit 3. 2. And 2. Lovely. Yeah, I don't think they stand a chance. This one right here. What's that one? That's a... Laser turret. The range on this is huge. Probably do getting rid of those trees though. Unpowered device fridge. Perfect. We don't need that running. Insufficient materials. CPU. Okay. Alright, here comes the attack though. We get to test this baby out. Let's speed it up. A little bit. And I'm going to get Connor grafted ready on here. Alas, I want you to... You'll be alright. You, you need to come in. The laser turret's already shredded. It's took it out about four. So we're looking pretty good. And then we'll... Just in case... I know we got the flame turrets as well, but... We'll make sure everyone's good. Quinn, you can carry on researching. Yeah, it's taken out about 15 before they even get here. Look, look at this. Didn't even need my people. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah, this is going to work out great. And there we go. We made real quick work of that. Uh, undraft everyone. You can all get back to work. 
hour wise yep nothing in the day either which is great so i think the only issue we're gonna have a little bit of damage to the walls here yeah the only issue we're gonna have is the thingy hmm i don't know what i mean by thingy what i'm trying to say ancient language has finished as well we got a lot of things to sort here um Wow, they are costly. Railgun snipers. We, we may as well queue it. I don't think we need anything else, do we? I kind of want them just to focus on this. And hopefully, he brings back something good from the balloon. We'll soon find out. Uh, production, I think what we're going to do... ...is we are going to build a couple more wind turbines by a couple more. I'm going to do a few more. I think. We'll make sure we are good. My only issue is if I if some of the attacks from over here. So yeah, I think a second turret on this though. That was crazy. Look, it took out... How many was that? 17 before it even had a chance. We could do with butchering those for the oil though. So we will queue all of those up. Krista reached farming five. That's perfect. So she can't go wrong now. Old equipment. Don't care. You'll be fine. You're all looking good. I think we got a couple of things. Oh, Quinn's got no shoes on though. Uh, got no... No boots. I can see a patch of some unknown plants. Oh, this might be something we need. Chew root, there we go. We've just got ourselves some chew root from your man. That's why it's good to send him, I guess. Until one. That means we'll get some leather boots on the go. I'm actually going to send those up. There we go. That's not bad. We got any more fuel? Wait, we've got 37 fuel, so we've got enough for another expedition as well. I kind of need them to find things now. Because I can't do a lot until then. And we've got some chew root. Hmm. But How many of these do we need? We'll patch a chew root. We can cook with those, can't we? Alice is going mining. But I think what I'm going to do is get all of this down whilst I can. Uh, I'm just going to slow this down a tiny bit whilst I sort this. We need fence. Stone. And we want... Uh, not sure how wide we want this. How do we want our feeder feeder lane to go here? To be honest. Yeah, I think that'll be cool. That'll do for now. So that means they have to come in through that bit. I've had nothing come from up here so far. I don't think there's much going on. We've got these nests to take out because I know that's your... Well, we need to observe stuff. There's a lot of other stuff we haven't observed actually as well. Like a flying insect if we can. We'll try. We'll see what happens. We also didn't observe an overgrown insect. I'm going to observe things as, as I find them now. That's probably what I need to do. I'll try one of those bloated things as well. I know Grayson is our researcher, so I won't send him out on the next expedition. Uh, I didn't check what the growth time was on those, actually. What is the growth time on a chew root? 12 days. Okay. Like a potato. Oh, Quinn's gone out to do it. Nice, thank you. Then we should be queuing up. Yep, some raw insect meat so we can get some more fuel on the go. I think as long as you butcher with the attacks, you're always going to have enough for the stuff you need, right? Grayson comes back just vomiting everywhere. Nice, he brought back some pickled veg and tenchi root. Good job. Ah, oh, looks like he's filling it straight back up, though. Good. And hopefully... Nope, he only put seven in. Okay, that's fine. And I think I need to queue up a little bit more traps here, which is going to be my next job. This might make, obviously, the time a little bit longer to do everything, but I think it's going to be worth it. 
But I think most of the time, they're going to come across that lane. If not, then we're pretty screwed, right? So if we stick a row just this side as well to cover us for that. I didn't do that right. Let's get rid of that and that. And then we'll do it properly. Because I could... I can fill up this side as well, right? Just to stop them. Stop them in their tracks if they come that way. I think if we go... Uh, fence and we bring... Down here as well. And we just do that. That covers us a little bit, doesn't it? So if they come in that way as well, we'll be covered a tiny bit. I don't know the range on that. Yeah, it covers there. That's good. Covers a whole good chunk, doesn't it? One has gone off on a sad wonder, though. Speed it up a little bit so they get back. How's this room looking? So this is at 9 degrees at the moment. But I think it's because this hasn't finished. I need them to hurry up with that. How are we looking? we got 550. Discovery of Scarabay. The bug I observed looked like an overgrown version of the pest that's known and hated on many worlds. Scarabay. Okay. We tend to swarm. Yep, yeah, we know that anyway. That's fine. We've got two on Meltdown. Good stuff. Got a lot of... I got my guys queued for a lot, haven't I? I kind of need more stuff done here. So, Grayson... Maybe who else needs to construct? Grayson's doing well on it. I think, yeah, he's interested in crafting. So I think I'm going to take him off that, getting back to the crafting of the CPUs here. I'm going to take him off handling so he sits on those two. And then Quinn, hopefully, will do the research as well. And we should be in a good spot. Uh, Why are you attacking me? Oh, of course. Right, Krista, I'm really sorry, but you're going to have to come and kill these. The buggers are coming to hit the fence. They want the crops. This is why, I guess, having the fence, the stone wall would help as well. Maybe having some floodlights out here would help too. With the shooting. You see how they're missing? If I can get them bleeding, that would be ideal. Oh, shoot from there. The night time is bad for that, isn't it? Oh, God. Get inside. Run them over to your turret or something. He got hurt. <laughs> oh, she's bleeding out. Get back inside. Get your, get your lady out. She'll sort them. There we go. Just need to get the sniper on it. And now... What is going on? <laughs> Alright, someone go and heal these two. Because they're both bleeding. Broken bone. Broken rib. Broken bone. Perforation. Infection. Nice. Going well. She's been stabbed. Grayson with that. Oh. Okay. Most curious. We need to do that expedition. Russian resource. And I need to send your man on it. Because we now have... Sensor fluctuations. Another ancient alien device. What was the other one? It was that one, wasn't it? Oh, ancient alien ship. Does that Tashian resource expire? No. Okay. And which one's closer? We're going to the alien ship. There you go, Talos. You're going. Right, guys. I do think that is a great place to end the episode, though. So, as always, if you have enjoyed, please do smash that thumbs up for me. If you are new around here, please do consider subbing to the channel. As always, guys, take it easy, and I'll catch you in the next one.